Hello, good evening. How are you? Good evening, coach. I'm fine, and you? Hello, Romeo. Um, yes, let's say I'm fine. Okay, are you ready? Today it's Monday. But I think you're ready, yes? Yes, of course. Did you rest? Descansaron, did you rest? Yes? So, so. So, so. Me too. I had a, a lot of things to do on the weekend. It was too short. I need a double Saturday. And of course, the Sunday. Or, or triple Saturday. Or triple, yes. Es que poquitos. Okay, Victor. Excellent, Kimberly. That's the attitude. Okay, you have to be happy because it's Monday. A new week. Okay. Adriana Beatriz. Ana Mercedes. Present. Excellent. Ah, Adrián. Hmm, were you sleepy? Okay. Ana Mercedes. Claribel. Esmeralda. No. Daniel Osgualdo. Present. Excellent. Dora Stephanie. Present. Excellent. Eloisa Abigail. Gloria Elizabeth. Present teacher. Excellent. Henry Oswaldo. Henry. Are you there, Henry? Hello. Eh, ando en la calle, por eso. Ah, ok. Jacqueline Beatriz. Present. Excellent. Deje de andar vagando, Henry. You have to be a good man. Jonathan Humberto. Present. Okay. Jose Angel. Present, teacher. Excellent. Catherine Stephanie. Present. Excellent. Kimberly Natalie. Present. Excellent. Lorena Araceli. Present. Great. Lourdes Paola. No. <clears throat> Mario Antonio. Present. Excellent. Marvin Alberto. Present. Excellent. Romeo Antonio. Present. Great. Ruth del Carmen. Present. Excellent. 
Verónica Elizabeth. Víctor Manuel. Sporking. No sé por qué no me los conecto. Xiomara Judith. Present. Excellent. And Catherine Jamilet. Catherine Jamilet. Present. Okay. Verónica Lourdes. Eloisa. Claribel. Ana Mercedes. Present. Present. Verónica presente, teacher. Ok. <laughs> Pero había escuchado. Ok, thank you, Verónica. Gracias. Lourdes also, right? No. Lourdes a la una, a las dos. No. Eloisa, yes. Present. En Claribel. Ana Mercedes. Present. Ok. That's it. Ok, today we're going to start section 3. We are going to talk about professions. No la habíamos empezado con ustedes todavía, ¿verdad? No. no. Section three. So let's see the vocabulary. Then we are going to classify the vocabulary words. Hi everyone, in this class you'll learn vocab jobs do. Let's get started by listening and practicing the vocabulary. One, he's a receptionist. Two, oh, she's a doctor. Three, she's a nurse. Four, he's a pilot. Five, she's a flight attendant. Six, He's a musician. Seven. She's a singer. Eight. She's a judge. Nine. He's a police officer. Ten. He's a lawyer. Eleven. He's a cook. He's a chef. Twelve. He's a waiter. Thirteen. She's a waitress. Fourteen. He's a salesperson. Fifteen. She's a cashier. Sixteen. She's a security guard. Now, let me write some additional. Okay. Now let's listen to your pronunciation. Okay, let's see number eight. Okay, Ana Mercedes, number one. One is they are patients. Number one, no. this one. Um, he's a nurse. Mm, no. no. Receptionist. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> he's a receptionist. 
I don't know how to say a nurse when is. It's the same. Men. No. It's the same. Okay. Okay. That's it. Yes. Okay. Number. Eloisa, number four. Eloisa. Ruth Villeda, number four. He is a pilot. Yes, correct. Hey, Lorena Araceli, number two. She's a doctor. She's a doctor. Okay, Xiomara Rodriguez, number five. She is flight attendant. Okay, she is a flight attendant. Number Veronica, number three. Uh, she is a nurse. She is a nurse. Okay, she is a nurse. Okay. Jonathan, number seven. Here, no veo los, los nombres y no me carga esto. Um, like Shakira, for example. She is a. She is a singer. Ya le soplaron, Jonathan. Well. Thank you. Yes, she is a singer. She's a singer. Next, Jacqueline, number eight. Um, she is a Hughes. ¿Cómo se dice juez? Judge. Uh, she is a George. 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 Okay, yes. Adriana, number six. He is a um, musician. 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 A musician, yes. He is a musician, yes. Mario, number nine. Is a police. A police officer. Police officer. Yes, he is a police officer. King Marvin, number 10. Marvin. Hola. Mm, no, ese no sé qué es. No. No. Ok, escoja otra víctima. ¿Cómo se pronuncia abogado? Lawyer. 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 Es muy similar a mentiroso. I don't know why. But it's a little bit different. Ok. A lawyer from... Ah, uh, como dijo la, la um, to say to tell in lies, liar, liar, uh -huh. liar, yes, to lawyer, a lawyer. 
Okay, Marvin, again, number 11. Yes, chef, he's a chef or he's a cook. No sé si la dijo Marvin, Marvin. It was good. Yes. Yes. He is a cook. Okay. And Gloria, number 12. Y, y se me olvidó cómo se decía mesero. Waiter. He is waiter. He is a waiter. He is a waiter. Ok. Acuérdense de... Bueno, no sé si... Wait. The wait. De esperar. Because you have to wait a lot when you go to a restaurant. Ok. So, waiter. A waiter. And uh, Daniel, number 13. She's waitress. She's a waitress, correct. Number 14, Kimberly. Kimberly, Natalie. Victor Manuel, number 14. Henry Oswaldo. Okay, Kimberly. Yes. He is a seller. He is a salesperson. Repeat, Kimberly. Dígalo otra vez, Kimberly. Sorry, teacher. No la escuché muy bien. He is a salesperson. Yeah, salesperson. Salesperson, okay. Number 15, Henry. Are you on the street yet? Yes. Okay. Uh, Catherine, Stephanie, number 15. Lourdes. Somebody. Hey, Romeo, creo que no le he preguntado a Romeo. 15, Romeo. Sí. Which one? Los oigo bien lejos, yes? Repeat, please. I don't remember in the pronunciation, teacher. Cashier. Ahora diga la oración completa. Llega Navidad. Hurry up, hurry up, Catherine. She is a cashier. Well, lo urdes. Are you there? 
Romeo, the last one, 16. She is a um, security work. Yes, she is a security work. You have to be ready, please. Try to be ready, even if you don't know the answer, but speak. And now we are going to classify this uh, jobs and to the places in which they work. For example, in a hospital, what professions do we have here? In a hospital, we have a doctor, a nurse, what else? Receptionist. A receptionist, okay. What else? Security worker. Yes, thank you. Security work. What about an office? In an office. A judge. A judge, okay. What receptionist. else? A receptionist. Lawyer. A lawyer, okay. Lawyer. Secretary. Secretary. Right. In a store. Cashier. A cashier, maybe. In. Yes. Okay. Salesperson. Salesperson. Excellent. Do we have more? Security work. Security work. Yes. One more. Receptionist. Mm. Okay. In a hotel. Chef. Chef or cook. Security work. Yes. Waiter. Waiter. Or waitress. Okay, one more. Receptionist. A receptionist. Oh, yes. Okay, yes. Okay, now what can you tell me about the things, their activities, or their duties? What do they do in their work? Mm, for example, a security ward. What do you think he or she is responsible of? or any other, could be the receptionist, the lawyer, the salesperson. Can, can you explain me what they do? No. Okay, for example, um, a doctor, Check the patients uh, gives medicine. Um, 
make surgeries. In, that's our activities that doctors do. What about the security work? Vaya, muy bien, les va a quedar de tarea, entonces, because you don't want to talk. Ok, van a escoger uno de cada categoría, one of each category, could be this or could be another. Ok, if you have uh, other professions or jobs that can fit in those places, like hospital, office, store, and hotel, you can include and uh, more vocabulary words here. So you're going to pick one from each category and you're going to explain what this, um, like the profile, the activities, their duties, what they have to do when during their, their job. Yes, it's clear. How many activities? In total, I don't uh, activities could be two, two or three. Yes, short. Yes, it's clear. Está claro eso que van a hacer for to for tomorrow. Okay, tomorrow I'm going to ask again, and I hope you are ready and you have something in your mind to say. Okay. Yes, teacher. Puede darnos un ejemplo de más o menos cómo lo quieren. Como el que les dije del doctor. The doctor checks uh, the patient's health. Or the doctor gives medicine. Uh, a nurse assists the doctor or helps the doctor. Pero ustedes van a hacer only one from each category. One from the hospital, one from an office, one from the store, and one from the hotel. Okay. Now let's practice this conversation. And he works in a hotel. Okay. Where does your brother work? In a hotel. Oh, really? My brother works in a hotel too. He's a front desk agent. How does he like? It? Not very much. He doesn't like the manager. That's too bad. What hotel does he work for? The Plaza. That's funny. My brother works there too. Oh, that's interesting. What does he do? Actually, he's the manager. Okay, volunteers to practice this conversation? Volunteer. Okay, Ruth. One more. You can do it. You can do it. Uno más para la conversación. Me. Okay, go. Uh, where does your brother work? In a hotel. Oh, really? My brother works in a hotel too. He's a front rice agent. How does he like it? Not very much. He doesn't like the manager. That's too bad. What hotel does he work for? The plaza. That's funny. My brother works there too. There too. Oh, that's interesting. What does he do? Actually, he's the manager. Okay, thank you. Two more volunteers. I need two boys. Boys, boys, boys.
Oh my God. Volunteers, men. Me, teacher. Me. Okay. Okay, Angel. And Veronica. Yes, teacher. Okay. Thank you. Where um, does your brother work? Uh, in a hotel. Oh, really? My brother works in a hotel too. How does from he like island. it? Sorry. How does he like it? No, very much. He doesn't like the manager. Does to ba ba what hotel does he work for? The plaza. That's funny. My brother works there too. Oh, that's interesting. What does he do? Actually, he's the manager. Okay, thank you. Yes. Questions? No les pregunté. About vocabulary or pronunciation? This agent okay. okay. It's so there are three words front, desk, agent. A little ah, more. Uh -huh. front, desk, agent. Okay. Uh, son como, I don't know in Spanish how do we call, but when you go to the hotel, you need to register. Uh, they give you your keys. Uh, when you leave the hotel, you have to pay there. And that's the, the what a front uh, desk agent does. Sería como... Um, I, I don't know in Spanish, but they are... Take for reservation. Yes, make reservation, take phone calls, and to pay the your stay in the hotel. Como un host. Como un? Un host. El que da la bienvenida. Te lleva al lugar. No. No, they cannot move, I think, from, from there. Creo que ellos no se pueden mover de ahí. O sea, todo lo, lo como cuando, sí le dan la bienvenida, because you, you went there, you say your name. For example, I have a reservation um, for Mrs. Córdoba. Okay, entonces... Ahí da sus datos, le entregan la llave. Y, y todo eso lo hace el, el front desk agent. Es como la cara de, del, del hotel. I, I, okay. I, yes, really, I don't know if they can move, but I assume that no, because they are front desk agent. So they cannot move from their desk. But they have another person that help with with the the luggage and the other things that are needed in a hotel. Okay. What about the manager? What what is that? Es como el gerente, quizá. ¿De? Es como el gerente. Yes, correct. Oh, the boss of the people that, that, that work in the hotel. Okay. Now we have the reduction of do and does. Bueno, more questions de esto. Mm. 
Sorry, que ya no les pregunté. Uh, no problem. No. Okay. And in those cases, um, when we have a word, well, when we have thus, and it is finished in S, right? And we have the next word that is start with a vowel because, um, digamos que you have to join. You have to join the two sounds. The last sound with the first vowel sound. Y se pronuncia como que si fuera only one word. Okay, for example, where does he work? Where does he work? De una sola vez, de corrido, sin hacer pausas. Okay, where does he work? What does he do? What does he? What does he? Um, y también a uh, la inversa sería you can end in a vowel and start the following word with a consonant eh, si recuerdan la y puede tener two sounds the consonant sound and the vowel sound pero en este caso actuaría como una consonant okay where do you work where do you work what do you do where do they work what do they do que se irían de corridas como juntas o unidas yes Well, this is um, for you to practice. We don't have, I think we don't have the, the listening, but you can practice. And then we have the double H questions in simple present tense. Ya habíamos visto las double H words. Ya habíamos visto la estructura que íbamos a seguir que íbamos a iniciar con nuestra doble H word, then we are going to add or use the auxiliary. Okay, we have do and does. Okay, does for a first person, for plural forms, and a does for third person singular. Do for plurals and for first person and does for third person singular. Okay. Como ya habíamos visto algunos ejemplos, vamos a ver. I'm going to make the questions to some of you and you're going to tell me real answers. Okay, real answers or things that are true for you. Okay, let's start with um, Jonathan. Where do you work? Eh, sería in a hospital. In a hospital? Sí. Okay. Real for you. Uh, what do you do? I am doctor. No, pero serían respuestas reales para usted. Oh, okay. O sea, no, no esas que están ahí, sino, a ver. O sea, yo le voy a hacer las mismas preguntas, pero usted me tiene que dar sus propias respuestas. Ok, let's try again. Where do you work, Jonathan? Mm. No trabajo. Okay, I I not work. I don't I don't work. work. I don't work. Okay. And so what do you do? If you don't if you don't work, 
What do you do? Jonathan. ¿Cómo sería? Perdón. ¿Qué hace? Muy bien. Ya establecimos que no trabaja, but what other thing do you do? Sería, ¿cómo se dice pasar en casa? Or, I am a student. ¿Podría ser esa o no? Ah, sí. Are you studying? Or did you finish? Did you already graduate from high school? High school. ¿Ya se graduó? Sí. Yes. Okay. So, you... Uh, but you are studying English. So, you can say that you are a student. And the last one, how do you like it? Do you like to be a, a student or do you want to be part of the job force? Jonathan. Muy bien, vamos a hacer las mismas preguntas. O sea, did, where do you work? What do you do? How do you like it? Okay, if you like to be a student or no, um, it's too boring, for example. Being a student, it's too boring. Or it's too difficult, it's too hard. I want to um, eat and then you, you can say, what do you want to do? Okay, now let's try with another volunteer. Um, me teacher. Okay, Veronica, thank you. Okay, where do you where do you work, Veronica? Yes, teacher, I work in a legal office. Excellent. What do you do? I am a lawyer. Excellent, great. How do you like it? Uh, I like to swim. You you like it? You like it? Okay. Muy bien, para este caso, you can say, eh, la, you can use, eh, really like, I like it, it's okay, mm. I hate it, uh, I love it, I enjoy it. Que cualquiera de estos podemos utilizar para hablar de likes and dislikes. Que porque hate es if, when you... Um, didn't like something. Okay. Now let's listen to Catherine Aviles and Dora Stephanie. Okay, una va a hacer las preguntas y otra va a contestar. Yes. Catherine Aviles. Let's try with um, Romeo. Y ya dije el otro, la otra persona. Una duda. Yes. Eh, serían preguntas, las tres preguntas que acaba de mencionar, ¿verdad, Miss? Yes. Ah, ok. Entonces sería, what do you work, ¿verdad? What, where? Where, Where do, you do you? Yes. Romeo. I don't work. Also, oh my god. Okay, and so continue with with the questions. What does he like? No, what do you do? Ah, oh, what do you do? Mm. Uh, I do a study. Okay, yes. Y la última. Mm. 
No la recuerdo. Eh, how? How do you like it? How do you like it? Okay, Romeo. Yes, I like it. Okay, thank you. Vamos con Xiomara Rodríguez en Ruth. Ayuda, Ruth. Yes. Okay. Okay. Una hace las preguntas y otra las respuestas. Um, where do you work? In the supermarket. I work in the supermarket. Okay. okay. Where do you like? No, perdón. When do you like? Sí, um, no, what, what do they do? Sería la siguiente. Ah, okay, perdón. I am a seller. A salesperson. Salesperson. I am okay. a salesperson. Okay. And ahora sí, la última. No sé cuál es la última. Eh, how do you like it? Ah, ok. How do you like it? Uh, I like it. Ok. The last two, last, last two volunteers. No more. Okay, let's continue. No hay más voluntarios. Me. Yes. Me. Okay. Pregunto yo. Yes, Jacqueline. Where, where do you work? In, in a health unit. In a? Perdón. Ina, repeat, please. In a health unit. Unidad de salud. Ah. Clínica. Okay. Clínica. Yes. Hmm. What do you do? What do you do? In, I am a doctor. How do you like it? Yes, I love it. Excellent. Okay, that's good. Okay, now you are going to write different questions. Now uh, let's do the exercise on the platform. Wait, 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 wait. What is it? Yeah. Look at the pictures and answers. Answer correctly. Esta es parecida a la que a la que hicimos. Okay, vamos a usar possessive adjectives here. Mire si se fija, what's his job? What's her job? Y vamos a ir de acuerdo al número. In number four, what his job? He's a pilot. He's a pilot. Yes. Number five, what's her job? He is a flying assistant. He or she? She. Yes. She is a flight attendant. Um, 
Number six, what's his job? He's a musician. He's a musician. What's her job? She's, She's a singer. singer. Yes. Number eight. She's a judge. Okay, yes. She's a judge. Okay. Number nine. He's a police officer. Yes. And number 10. Number 10. He's a lawyer. He's a lawyer. Yes. En la 9 le faltó la letra E. The officer. He's a police officer. Uh, it's a mess. Mm. No, right. I know Miss Sally. Miss Number ten. What's his job? He's, He's a, a cook. cook. Okay. Or a chef. Okay. Twelve. He's a waiter. He or she? Complete. He's a waiter. He's a waiter. He's a waiter. He's a waiter. Okay, 14. Me faltó la 3. Ay, sorry. What's her job? She is a waitress. Okay, aquí tiene que ir poniendo la mayúscula y el punto para que no le vaya a dar problema. Y el apóstrofe, mi apóstrofe. Ahora sí, for king. What's his job? He's six years Okay, he's a six years person. Fifteen. It's a cashier. He or she? She. She's, okay. She's a cashier. Sixteen. A security work. Yes. She. He's a security. Es por los puntitos. Ah, sí, ya está ahí. Mm. 
Okay. Yes. Mm, let's see. Mm, let's see. Mm, let's see. Mm, let's Okay, and we only have two minutes. The next exercise, well, we have the reduction. Ah, si está de el audio. Hi, everyone. In this class, you'll learn to sound natural when asking simple, not understand the program on TV, even though you understand the script or dialogue in writing. This is a big pronunciation topic. However, in this class, we will talk about the reduction of do and does. Pronunciation. Reduction of do and does. Listen and practice. Notice the reduction of do and does. Where do you work? What do you do? Where does he work? What does he do? Where do they work? What do they do? If we analyze the first example, where do you Okay. I said you can listen again and practice to join the two sounds. Okay? And we don't have time for the next exercise. So we're going to continue tomorrow. Okay, let's check the attendance one more time. Laribel? No? Lourdes? No? No here? Okay, so remember to do the homework for tomorrow. Okay, hace la tarea que le dije que mañana la voy a preguntar. So you have to think and you have to be ready okay, to answer what you are going to say. Okay? Questions? Okay. It's clear. Está claro lo que van a hacer para el día de mañana as a homework. Al final, ¿cuántas descripciones haría? One. Yes. One for each place. Una por lugar. Okay. Yo quiero, eh, Miss, yes. le voy a decir en español, no sé yeah. si yo entendí bien. Es, digamos, una, pro, o sea, un oficio o una profesión por cada uno de los lugares, digamos, qué hace en el hotel, qué hace en el hospital y así. Yes, for example, if I say the doctor, de, del hospital yo voy a escoger al doctor. Entonces, okay. tiene que explicar qué hace, cuáles son sus actividades. Algo breve, ok, not, not too long, sino que puntual, ok, the doctor does, do, 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 and ya, yes, yes, Thank ok, you. more questions, it's clear, ok, we are going to finish with that, and we are going to see each other tomorrow, Okay, until tomorrow. Recuerde prepararse su sopita de pericos para el día de mañana, please. Good night, Bye. 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 See you tomorrow.